plays here today on Prize Picks. Again, there is a link in the description below to sign up for Prize Picks. They will match 100% of your first deposit. Also, there is a free Discord link as well as Patreon link in the description below as well. But let's not waste any time, you guys. Let's get right into it. Again, I do want to preface that I'm not a financial advisor or not a gambling expert. These are just the plays that I'm looking at making. But let's go. So, a ton of MLB games on the slate tonight. Um, some games starting pretty quickly here, under an hour. But the first play that I like is going to be Shane McCallahan, McClanahan. Um, I think that's how you pronounce it. Seven strikeouts. And I'm going to take the over on this one. And I like the push factor, obviously, being seven. But Shane McClanahan leading the MLB in strikeouts at 89. Um, the line is seven, so he's hit at least seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten of 11 starts this season, he's had at least seven strikeouts. Facing the St. Louis Cardinals away, or their their Tampa Bay is at home, so St. Louis Cardinals are on the road, and the Cardinals against uh, right-handed pitchers on the road. You can see here, um, right here down below, near the bottom of the league in strikeout percentage at 21 percent. Let's check out their batting average. St. Louis hitting 250 against righties on the road, but Shane McCall McCl McClanahan, sorry, his uh, let's see his uh, swing to miss ratio is crazy if you take a look at it let's see his advanced stats here uh k's per nine innings k's per nine innings insane 12.45 over this season uh, walks per nine innings 1.68 right here k percentage 36 percent so this is a no-brainer for me to take the potential push factor here shane mcclanahan uh seven strikeouts i love the over on this one um another strikeout prop that i like is logan webb in his five strikeouts, again, another potential push. Logan Webb, you know, pitching great this season, 5-1, 3.82 ERA, 56 strikeouts. Facing the Colorado Rockies uh, in San Francisco, and he's had, he's hit this over five, uh, six, ten, six, six, his last four games, actually five of his last six games, he's had at least five strikeouts. And the Colorado Rockies, um, right-hander pitchers against right-handers on the road. Let's take a look at this really quick. Yeah, so right-handed pitchers away, you can see here the Colorado Rockies near the bottom of the league as far as average. They've had 215 against righties uh, on the road. So Colorado obviously does very, very well against lefties. Um, right-handers is kind of a different story, especially on the road, not playing in Corpse Field. Uh, I like the over here for Logan Webb, five strikeouts. At bare minimum, we'll take the push on both of these, um, in my opinion. And again, I'm going to get four plays today, but I do recommend because of these two potential pushes, you do add a fifth pick. Um to whatever you know you feel most confident in in my opinion uh the next one is going to be last strikeout prop here it's going to be garrett cole seven and a half uh gotta take i'm thinking the over here on this one uh garrett cole you know just a strikeout pitcher nine ten eleven five nine ten six nine three six and three but he's been really gearing up really gearing up as of late um as far as these strikeouts go and seven and a half seems Pretty fair for, uh, you know, Garrett Cole here. Definitely the most risky play of the four. I also kind of like Chris Bubik here at three. Um, I just think that's such a low prop for a starting pitcher, and he's maybe good for three to four innings. So this is also a good one as well, but I'm going to go with Garrett Cole over seven and a half here. So two uh, pretty high strikeout props here, Garrett Cole and Shane McClanahan, that we're going to ride with today. Um, it's going to be very, very interesting. And then the last one is going to be a pitch is thrown. And we're going to go with, uh, where is he? Jordan Lyles, over 91.5. But this has actually jumped up. It was at 88.5, jumped up to 91.5. Um, so he need, he's going to need 92 pitches to get this through. But you can see here, Jordan Lyles, um, his last outing only pitched 83 pitches, but he pitched five innings. But after that, 93, 117, 106, 91, 90, 101, 93, 91. So all he needs is 92 tonight. Uh, facing Kansas City should be a pretty good game here. Kansas City doesn't have a ton of bats, so I expect him to pitch pretty well. Um, 92 pitches. They're trying to push Jordan Lyles, I think, as far as he can go. Um, you know, as far as pitch, starting pitchers on the Rangers, he's definitely going uh, the longest into these games, him and John Gray. So those are the four plays uh, that I have for today's MLB slate. Again, I recommend in case of the two pushes, maybe adding a fifth play. Uh, definitely maybe a hit fantasy score. There's a few that I like here as well. I like Joey Votto's hit fantasy score. Uh, today, I like, obviously, Mookie Betts or Paul Goldschmidt's. Paul Goldschmidt's dropped here. This was looking actually pretty promising at 6.5. Um, honestly, I might take this as my fifth, but I'm not going to throw it to you guys. But, yeah, 
four plays here on price picks let me know in the comments below you guys feel about them hit that subscribe button notification bell drop a like on this video and as always have a great day